have a special guest in studio, Nancy Chaplin from Heartfelt Handbags and Backpacks. Hello. Hi, Hi Kim. How are you? Very good. So what's going on with your project? What's the, the basis of it all? Well, the basis is a simple Facebook page that I saw, a friend of mine down in Arizona, and she had a picture of a handbag and a request to fill it with uh, personal items, feminine hygiene products, personal hygiene items, and snacks for homeless ladies. And then through conversations with my sons and my boyfriend, we decided to uh, include men in backpacks and to fill backpacks and purses with personal items and snacks and anything that a homeless person could possibly need to know that they're loved through the holidays. Well, everybody needs personal items like that. Snacks especially, too, because you don't always have the money to go and buy a bag of cheesies or something like that when you're out on the streets. What are you guys looking for the most? Well, what I've been telling people to do is when they wake up in the morning and they think of the simple items that they use every morning, their toothbrush, their toothpaste, the gloves that they put on their hands, the toques, feminine products for ladies, tampons, shavers for men, small shaving creams, anything that you have extra of. A lot of people are going out and buying it in in mass quantities, but some people are just pulling out that extra toothpaste that they've got under the sink, that extra bar of soap. The place that we're delivering it to is the neighborhood center on the south side, and they have facilities for the homeless so that they can go in and shower. They have resources for so many people, and there is an abundance of homeless and a lack of love. And where can they drop that off? You just mentioned the Neighborhood Centre. Can they also drop things off here at the station, just off St. Albert Trail? They can drop things off at the station here at St. Albert Trail, as well as uh, High Energy Ladies Health and Fitness in St. Albert. It's on McKinney Avenue. And um, as well as um, look at the Mother May I Fly Facebook page and the MotherMayIFly.com website. And Mother's spelt with a U. Um, my father's from Newfoundland, so... Mother, nice. you know, me, 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 me mother and me fodder. Nice. <laughs> so what can people do if they're in need of the backpacks? Not just drop off, but what if they need them themselves? They can go to the Neighbourhood Centre, which is on the south side. It's 7221 104th Street. And uh, the hours um, are on the website. Now, I know that's not helpful for people that are necessarily homeless, but they have daytime hours. Um, It's not a facility that you can sleep at, but it is a facility that you can visit during the day. Awesome. And I'll grab some more information from you. We'll put it on our Facebook page and on the website so that people can find that there. Thank you so much for coming in. You're welcome. Happy holidays. Yes, happy holidays to you too.